Now I want to talk about the slant or oblique asymptotes that occur in some rational functions. And they occur if the degree of the numerator is exactly one more than the degree of the denominator. And here's the function we're going to consider. Minus 3x squared plus 2 divided by x minus 1. And to find the slant as asymptote, we're going to need to use polynomial long division. So here's my numerator. And here's my denominator. And I'm going to ask myself, how many times does x go into minus 3x squared? Well, it's going to go in minus 3x times. Then I multiply. Minus 3x times x is minus 3x squared. Minus 3x times minus 1 is 3x. And then, just like in regular division, I subtract this line from this line. It's going to leave me minus 3x plus 2. So again, I'm going to see how many times does x go into minus 3x? That would be minus 3. And I multiply. Minus 3 times x gives me minus 3x. Minus 3 times minus 1 gives me plus 3. When I subtract this line from this line, my remainder is minus 1. <clears throat> so this result tells me that I have a slant asymptote at the line y equals minus 3x minus 3. And the function is graphed here. It's the black lines. This red dashed line is your slash, is your slant asymptote. And this dashed yellow line is your vertical asymptote that you can see that you cannot have 1 in for this function, or you'd be dividing by 0. So these are the asymptotes that, design, that um, define this function. Here's a second example. I'm interested in the function y equals 2x squared over x plus 1. And if I do this long division, I'm going to have 2x squared plus 0x plus 0 divided by x plus 1. When I do this math, I'm going to get 2x minus 2 with the remainder of 2 over x plus 1 as my result. And this is going to tell me that I have a slant asymptote here at the line 2x minus 2, which is graphed in blue. It's the blue la dashed line over here. Also in this function, I'm going to have a vertical asymptote at x equals minus 1, which is shown in green. And then this is how the function interacts with those asymptotes.